firstly i will uh, confirm you and demonstrate you how to use this instrument on a standard resistance box well uh, these are the normal uh, testing pro provided by the sigma people to check your samples and uh, for different applications it isn't having a crocodile clip on it okay but i won't be using this uh, for now i will be using uh, i made my my lead set will be having both the ends will be the same one and will be using onto the standard resistance box well this is a standard resistance box they have provided to me it will be having all the seven ranges on it let's see this is a thousand micro ohm this is 10 milli ohm 100 milli ohm 1 ohm then they have provided a common port on it and uh, it will be having a 10 ohm 100 ohm and 1 kilo ohm so let's start with it firstly i will be inserting the pole uh, lead set on the instruments two are the black leads and two are the red leads so i will be putting all the red leads onto the red ports and on the black one on the black ports okay now i will be putting it onto it and i will be using the last range it's one kilo ohm it is showing thousand ohm which is one kilo ohm only okay now i'll be changing the range to 100 milli ohm 100 ohm and it is showing to me it's 99.3 and the accuracy part of this standard resistance box is also 0.5 percent so we can say that the instrument as well as the box so both the values are correct and the instrument is working fine on the 100 ohm range then this is the 10 ohm range i'll be shifting it the switch onto it it's showing 10.03 so this range is also working and the standard box is also correct now i'll be shifting for the for one ohm you have to use all the four wires because it's a low resistance that's why you have to use four wire technology to check the instrument see now it is showing it's thousand milli ohm it's one ohm means thousand milli ohm now i'll be shifting it to 100 milli ohm the third range of the, the standard resistance box and it is showing to me yes it is showing 100 milli ohm to me four now i will be going to 10 milli ohm and it is showing yes this this range is also working means the box as well as the instrument is working perfectly fine you can buy this standard resistance box also with the instrument sigma people is having both the standard boxes as well as the instrument with them so you can also check and uh, cross verify your product your micrometer is it working fine in all the ranges or not so it's better i should also uh, recommend this thing that you should go for it you should buy standard resistance box it will be good for use at uh, in the production part you can firstly check the instrument of yours is working or not if it is working fine in every range means your instrument is correct and then you can use into your production and application part 